So today we're going to show you how to do a quick drawing with the brush tool in Illustrator and setting this up real quick. I've got a round brush and a new artboard and we're going to show you how to color it using, um, you know, a basic shape in our in our Pathfinder. So I'm going to draw, let's just draw a big eye here. So I'll do a line up over the top. I'm going to make sure that I crisscross my lines. You'll see why in just a minute. because I know that the eyeball does go past the lines of the lids. Draw a little circle in here, and I'm also going to make sure I crisscross those lines. Thank you. Um, the next thing I want to do, once I've got my basic lines in, is to select them all using the black arrow selection tool, V keyboard shortcut, and I need to go to object menu and expand appearance. Notice that makes all of my stroke lines into fills. They are still individual lines, right? And they have a black fill instead of being a black stroke. Let me select them again. So then I'm going to pull up my Pathfinder. Pathfinder is awesome. Love the Pathfinder. I'm going to go ahead and at this point and hit divide. What that does is cuts all my shapes apart from each other. They are still grouped, I think. Yeah. So we'll need to use our white direct selection tool to select these paths that we don't want and delete them with delete on my keyboard. You see this here, though? It does leave behind some empty, no-fill, no-stroke shapes. I'm going to select one of those and go to my Select menu, select the same, fill and stroke, all of those empty vectors, hit Delete, get rid of those. And then I'm going to continue about my business getting rid of these unwanted extra shapes. I'm going to do a simple one, so it goes pretty quickly. All right, so there, oh, yeah, this guy, and uh, maybe this one out here. All right, so there's a pretty simple eye. So now how am I gonna color it? Because right now I've got nothing in here and nothing in there and nothing in there. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put these lines back together. Back to Pathfinder, the only two parts I ever use, Unite and Divide, I'm gonna use Unite. Notice all the vectors in between are gone. And I'm gonna create a shape that covers this whole eye like so, make it a weird color yellow and right click arrange send it to the back okay now guess what i'm going to do back to the pathfinder select it all divide it up now i've got multiple shapes of yellow got one on the outside that i can delete if i want to I've got ones in here that i can make a red or something the corner fleshy part of the eye this one shift that one make them white the colored part of your eye there and then this guy will make it black and there we go i might even combine this shape with this shape with my pathfinder and if you don't want it to have such a uniform you know look to it you can even you can even still because they're vectors you know drag any part of it down and make your um you know your lines different but that's not really helping me it's terrible if I simplified it a little bit, it'd be better. Get rid of some of the extra points. That's how you're going to color in a line drawing uh, with the brush using Pathfinder and a little bit of other arranged tools, things like that. Hope you enjoy. Happy drawing.